What's up, y'all? Got a banger from Alpha Central. Let's get straight into it. Yo. How big is your Three inches. From the floor. Shots fired! <laughs> Shots fired! I know you guys have heard that one. God, I'm so stupid. Stupid. Big enough. Like, what's does that mean? How many miles do you have on your cooch? Shots fired! Shots fired! What'd you tell us that? She's a runner. She's a track star. He goes like what? I hate you. The mile the video. What the video? Good night. Good night. That was weird. Well, that was a weird question. So his response seems pretty normal to me. You say you say what? No, 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 no. You don't get to be passive aggressive. That's that's not what What did you say the first time? Did you hope you hope she leaves me? That's fucked. Oh. You went to high school with me. Nice. Uh, what's your name? No. Tech Theater. You were in Tech Theater. Nice. Okay. Well, I don't remember you being such a <laughs> then. <laughs> the thing is, she's in the crowd, he's on stage, she's probably just mad. People want to see you win, but they don't want to see you do better than them. Always remember that, gents. I mean, that's a pretty valid response if I mean, you ask it's me. Just facts. It's him on the stage, not her. Get the mic. Are you deaf? Yeah. I know. Let me get the mic. Why? Because girls are on top. Nobody wants to see a boy on TV. This is about hockey, not girls. This is about girls. I like hockey. Cringe. Cut it. Just cut it off. She should be at herself because that was just Think if a guy did that. Think if a guy assaulted a girl like that. Like, they'd be up in arms. Inch. I can't get $2,600. Read the estimates, Sarah. That was, the first bill was totally different than this bill. Oh, shit. I pay you no. after you're finished. Because I don't trust you. I think because that's how it works. I told you that I had a deadline. I told you that I had a deadline. Okay, and now you're just pulling up because of two thousand dollars. What kind of a person are you? You're a person. <laughs> 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 this is why I say women grow old; they never grow up. Sarah, stop. I'm acting like a child, bro. <laughs> okay, but was the scream really that necessary? Nobody would have believed it if they wouldn't have got it on camera. Mr. Avery, no disrespect, but it's first woman. First woman. First girl. Oh, for real? I'm so yeah, sorry. First, first woman. Okay, <laughs> let's get it right. Switch your girl, Nina, read it, and I am the MILF, the cougar of the two. I think the word MILF and cougar has been misused. I think a lot of these ladies like to use that term. It's like, you're just old and ran. Shots fired! Shots fired! That's all it is. Like, back in the day, it used to have some appeal, that word. Let me know Let me know what you think, gents. Did the word MILF used to have a different bit of a connotation back in the day? Nowadays, it just means you're a runner. She's a runner. She's a track star. That's just my personal opinion. Who popping? Oh, you didn't see the bank account or the cootie cat. Oh, you don't see the head eye game I got. Oh, sh I cook, I clean, I swallow. Pop one more goddamn balloon and see what happens. You gonna? It don't matter. It don't. You broke it. I can tell you that. And hold on. Not only is he broke. Shame, insult, guilt, and the need to be right. This is a forty-something-year-old woman trying to charge up a younger guy, bro. You can't make this stuff up. I need a diamond tester. I need a diamond tester for that. Oh, you so mad? You got something to say? I need the cooch facts. <laughs> Where's the cooch fax at? <laughs> Instead of the car fax, you know? Bro, your shoe got Kool-Aid Kool stains on them, bro. Come on. Well, my bank account is seven <laughs> figures. What's your look like? Don't about that. We, don't, you do. we don't care about I'm that. I'm going to need you to have some straight teeth, some white teeth, and a clean tongue. Your s*** low. Bro, let me know in the comments. Do, gents, do you care how much a woman makes? I'll be honest. A, a millionaire will go marry a woman who's on fries at McDonald's. Bro, we don't care. I don't f*** yellow. I'm a... You right or right? I am 45. Ooh. Ask your daddy about me, baby. <laughs> Ask your daddy about me, boo. I, I, okay? I, 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 I got your mama crying. Don't play with me. I do f you, but I'm gonna take this one. I have to pop all of them. Gotta pop the balloons oh, except for one. Can we do three? Is <laughs> y'all Oh! All right, I'm gonna keep this one. You're gonna pop me, ain't you? Go ahead, you can do it. You can do it. Oh! I'm gonna say she's. She's hyper masculine, combative, argumentative. Let me know in the comments. Would you pick her? Personally, I would never. 
When she first came in the room, you could already tell that this was not going to end well. Not only did she manage to make men pop their balloons, but she showed how much of a sore loser she really is yeah. to the whole internet. She's a runner, she's a track star. She's a runner, she's a track star. She's a runner, she's a track star. <laughs> Jesus can't say <save> these. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you trying? He's a hundred percent right. If Jesus can't Seven, save them, then 19. we can't at all. Some big numbers there, buddy Yikes. boy. You looking for a plus one? No, sorry. Well, I can like show you how to actually golf. Yeah, <laughs> but there is another bay open right there, I think. Well, your bay. No, I think you should grab that one. No, like your bay. No. Mm, yeah. Who, who are you? Remember, girls, <laughs> no means no. God damn, I look good. I'm not even gonna say nothing. You know what I mean? I'm not even gonna say nothing. I'm gonna be a good guy on this. I'm not even gonna say nothing. Y'all know, y'all know, y'all know, know. I usually be cooking people like Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> Helter Skelter, Ichabod Crane. <laughs> look at looking like somebody from the Thundercats. Shots fired. I don't even know. Shots fired. God. <laughs> Looking like a skeleton with flesh on it. I'm a lie, don't care who tell it. That person in the first part of the clip looks like a fish from Shark Tales. <laughs> I wanted to. How many that one before? guys do you think you could get in a day? As much as I wanted. As much as you want? Like, let's say you wanted to. You get like three? Yeah. Well, I'll be the judge of that. You're confident in that? Yes. Would you be down to test it? Oh. Ask a guy, like, hey, would you hook up see if you say yes? Yeah. Let's see. Oh, she getting you next it for show. Sure. Right Hi. Hi. I'm Paisley. Nice I'm Colin. Nice to meet you too. <laughs> if she asked you to hook up, would you say yes? No. That's my dog. <laughs> that's, that's my dog. My dog. No? No. Okay. I mean, I have confidence, but I respect your response. Okay. What would you rate her? Oh. Uh, <laughs> can I get a spin? Can I get a spin? You no, know, little booties matter, you know? I'll give you like a... A seven? Seven? Yeah, a seven. A seven? Yeah. Okay. I'm more What's a ten? Seven. What's a ten? I say perfect. I don't think nobody's See, perfect. Think about yourself. I give myself seven or 6.5 on a good day. It's a humble guy, you know? Not crazy. Factuals. Like, do, you think, do you think that seven was fair? No, I know. I think she's a ten. I think she's a ten. Yeah. I think yeah. my flat-chested friend's a, a freaking 10. Delusional. Just like so what delusional, he's... dude. Loki, does somebody want a carrot? Go to your place. Wait. Free. Wait. Free. Go to your place. Begging for a carrot. Cass is out there cleaning right now, so he's all, like, at the door and stuff. He said, a 10 is perfect and no one is perfect. If you're an trans model and you're doing all kinds of girly fans, you know, and then you expect your dude to respect you and not follow other women, you're delusional. You Facts. are undressing in front of a bunch of men all over the world. How dare you have that even remotely double standard that your guy can't do what you're already doing. You can't be a fans model and then say you're a monogamist. There's just no way. I mean, it's if you're not just sleeping social. with anybody else and you're not meeting up with anybody else, you're sharing your body and these personal things that should be only reserved for the person that you're with or married to. If Facts. you're married and you're a fans model and you're sharing your body on the internet and I can pay to see your in a hole, you are not a monogamous woman. I'm sorry. You're showing your private parts to Face. other people who are not your husband. I agree with this take. Chat, let me know what you think. I agree completely. Because when you take that vow, when you get married, you're vowing to be for that other person and only Facts. for that other person. She did not say one thing that is wrong. Right, Being monogamous means you and your partner and that's it. When you do OF, you're inviting people to see the things only your boyfriend should see. It's five dollars or kiss our <laughs> you mean I'm not fiber. kissing nobody's <laughs> You can keep the five. You ain't get, yeah, you ain't getting five dollars. No problem. All right. <laughs> You might need to pay that man way more These money for him to throw really away his they pride the cram. For that. Tell me why the cram of the crop, bro. Is that carrot good, bro? I don't know if you can hear him. He's just. <laughs> 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 He'd be munching on these carrots, dude. I'm so mad when an ugly man approaches me or tries to hit on me. Who's gonna tell her? Oh, Lady J is. There's a couple of possibilities here. The first one being, and 
honestly the most often overlooked one is is that a lot of guys that aren't considered to be as traditionally attractive as others are used to getting rejected by women so therefore they quite often will shoot their shot with a woman that they find attractive why because at worst they're just going to get rejected like they usually do but at best at least they can say that they shot their shot and maybe there's a possibility that she'll be interested but they're never going to know unless they try but then there's the other reason like it's because you're also beat. Shots fired! Shots fired! Everything on you is fake. Your lips are fake, your teeth are fake, your eyelashes are fake, but you want us to keep it real? Hmm. The audacity, like, stay in your lane. Stay in your lane. And that reason is one that a lot of individuals might have problems facing up to is that that individual might actually be on one's equal attractiveness level. Facts. And one just had an entirely overinflated sense of how good one looks the entire time. Stay in your lane? Okay, smush face. <laughs> <laughs> Seeing all these average mid-men on a museum dates with some of the most beautiful women I've ever seen, y'all don't know how good you have it. Meanwhile, you're single and alone at Loki. a museum Go taking videos of strange couples who look pretty happy and minding their own businesses. I don't know, but that does sound pretty mid to me. Cheers. Plus, that's a bit creepy and judgmental. Right? Let's just not take videos of strangers in public. Man. Are you gonna pay for this? Nope. <sighs> nah, you got it, bro. Nope. Boss okay. baby, independent chick. Sorry, right, no. Men aren't men these days anymore. I gotta pay for everything, I guess. Uh, what? You sneak this in like... No, I'm serious. She brought deodorant in the purse? Hmm? Man, you got it, bro. Like... It's a dollar. Pay I don't even it. know. Do y'all take your app, Apple Pay? No, Okay, well, let's have If you're it. broke, just say that. We're in the car, so I guess we can go. Damn. I'm serious. I'm sorry about that. You know, maybe if I maybe if I had a real gentleman, you know, he would have just paid for it, but whatever. Thank you. Bro, so you're just embarrassing. Why, why you why you why you no. don't got why you don't got your car? Because you I left it in the car. Why you did why you can't be my man and make sure I got all my stuff? You just made me embarrass myself. Now, now you talking about your man. Just a couple seconds ago, you was arguing with me and doing all this extra. Hey, yeah, because you stay doing little stuff. Right, I don't, I don't right, understand. Bro. All right, bro. Like it's cool. Bro. I'm not tripping, bro. Like, okay. You're not you, tripping. You, you just, you just, you just don't got an orange juice. Okay. You just made me embarrass myself in Walmart. I didn't make you do nothing. Yes, you did. You can't make someone embarrass themselves. It's like, how can I mess up your self-esteem? That's the way you feel about yourself, stupid. Stupid. Come on now. You don't got your car, that's on you. Okay, so why Facts. you can't pay for I don't it? Pay for your sh you broke. I'm broke? You broke. Alright, if I'm broke, then stop talking to me then. If he's broke, then she must be homeless because she's the one begging for a man to pay for her stuff. <laughs> why Fair is it that the finest guys in the world never leave the house? Because I already got one expensive hobby draining my wallet, I don't need another. That train will that definitely train be set. taking him places, unlike her. He took that wig he and ran with it. Wig. I just want to know how we knew it was a wig. <sighs> I'm getting too old for the dealers and the scammers. Like, I want a stable man. I want a good man. I, I want understand this. Leave those men alone. You aren't going to do anything but break those men's heart. Mm -hmm. What some of you don't realize is before your frontal lobe developed, you thought being with the bad boys was fun and exciting, right? So that's the lifestyle you've come to. But now some of you, since your frontal lobe is developing, you've now understood, well, maybe this isn't the life I want to live anymore. Mm -hmm. A lot of you are going to think these good guys are boring because they don't live the fast life. That's the easiest way I can put it. And I'm not trying to say you guys don't deserve love. But you have been making decisions time after time of deciding to be with someone that you knew wasn't good for yourself. Y'all will even say it, I'm ready for a good guy. So what does that mean you've been entertaining for the last 20 something years? And not Thanks. only that, I'm sorry, you've been giving yourself away to people that weren't And then now you want someone to put you on a pedestal after you've been dogged out all these times? <laughs> Let's she's a runner, she's a baby. track star. This is what you call stupidity. Well, and here's the thing. These women want to go have fun with all these guys, and then they want the nice guy later on in life. But here's the thing. Nice guys, good guys, that lifestyle is boring. Like, to this guy's point, they want to live the fast life. 
They want the money, the cars, the clothes, the, the thrill of it all. Whereas when you get with a good guy who's got his life actually together, he's mature and more than likely he has a strict routine. He does the same thing every single day, just like me. I wake up, you know, 6 a.m. every day, go to the gym, go to work, and then I, you know, work my nine to five and then I work a five to nine. And then I go to sleep. I watch some TV with Cass and then I, I walk low key. Like my, my days are mundane and boring. Good relationships are boring. Let me know in the chat. Do you agree? Let me know in the comments as well. Do you think good relationships are boring? Because here's the thing. A good relationship has a routine. If you don't have a routine, your life is chaotic. It's sporadic. You don't have any like foundational like discipline. You have to have the discipline in your life to have a good relationship. And the thing is, these ladies, they don't want that. They want the fast life. They want what's fun and exciting and thrilling and good relationships are boring. It's just because we have more routine. They expect to have a good man wait for them and that's just not gonna happen. Would you rather have 15 minutes with me or GTA 6? GTA 6. Really? Why? After that 15 minutes, what? Nothing? You don't think it would be good enough? GTA 6 stays. 15 minutes and- Plus GTA 6 is a long anticipated game. Well, game. you're more like a short term mistake. Do you want to know why he's Let not? me know in the comments. Are you guys going to get that game? Personally, I, I might even buy it. I'm texting you right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's called having fun. Something that maybe she should try. We are the Rolls Royce. Damn. It looks like it has less miles than you, so definitely the car. Less miles? I've never run a mile in my life. Okay, well, guess my body count then. 100 plus. Too high. Huh? Let me hop in the car. You don't want to hop in me? No, 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 <laughs> go away. I'd take that car over almost anyone. Not sure what she was expecting. How long have you been single for? <laughs> no, 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 I'm in a relationship. He says he'll propose to me, but he never does it. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, the ring he got me, he's like... Big back, big back, big back, big back. Tore up my finger and he hasn't got me a new one, so... Sounds sad. <laughs> <laughs> Usually everyone's like, ja, ja, ja. This bitch is that right now. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm, I'm engaged and not really. <laughs> Delusional. <laughs> Who are you texting? <laughs> Your pretend fiance? <laughs> <laughs> Where is he? He's a firefighter for DC. Alright, call him because I want to know what's up with his ring. <laughs> <laughs> I, I want to know because I, I, I bought myself a ring and then I had to return it. You bought the ring? What happened with the ring? Did you, did you buy a ring for her? Oh, she, he's wearing a ring. No, he, I gave him a ring, but I don't have a ring. She said that she don't got a ring, bro. The ring is damaged. What happened? Did you buy it or not? But she don't got it. Okay, who's lying? Dog, your girl's a liar, bro. No, 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 no. I had the ring, and the ring was damaged, and now I don't have a new ring. Why? Why don't I have a new ring? You made it seem like he didn't buy you a ring. Okay, she did. Okay. Well, then, <laughs> he definitely he bought her a ring, bro. but then she, but then she broke it. Like that, bro. <sighs> you can't make this stuff up. You really can't make this stuff up. Bought her a ring. Wants to fake and, and wants to lie and make him look bad. When in reality, it's her own fault. That's why I say, dude, accountability is the plague to these modern women. Just own up to it. He bought you the ring. What are you even talking about? This is why I say you should date these women for multiple years before buying them a ring, because you need to make sure they're actually serious about you. They can go through the thick and the thin, but a lot of guys don't want to do that. And I don't blame them. A lot of men are going their own way because if this is the real estate that we have to pick from, I'm gonna keep it a buck, it's pretty bad. Not a lot of choices out there right now. I remember back in my day when a woman would tell you her true intentions with you, whether she wanted to just buck you or she wanted to be in a relationship. I remember when you could just be straight up honest with a woman and she wouldn't judge you for it. But nowadays you just can't do that. And the thing is a lot of these women they want the bad boys. They want the fast lifestyle. They don't want the good guys. There's so many good guys. There's a lot of good guys that watch this channel. There's a lot of great guys that watch this channel. Guys that work blue collar jobs, truck drivers, guys that work concrete, blue collar, like out there busting up, you know, concrete, uh, freaking mowing lawns, all the things that keep like the infrastructure of everyday life going on. There's a lot of these guys that watch the channel. Shout out to you guys. But a lot of ladies don't give you guys a chance because you're not at the bars all the time. And the thing is, you work, you go home and you do your thing. And I'll, and I'll leave you guys with this. A lot of the modern women out there right now, they want to, instead of being your peace, they want to be a piece of the problem. I'll say it again for the ones in the back. They don't want to be your peace. They want to be a piece of the problem. It's absolutely wild to me. Loki, did you have a good time today? You didn't even eat your carrot, dude. 
I guess he wants something other than a carrot. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Go cop the ebook, The Four Pillars of Personality. We've sold over 50 copies now. Shout out to you guys. Thank you so much. Um, I'm going to come out with the volume two because it seems like a lot of you guys got a lot of value out of it. But the ebook is in the description. The Four Pillars of Personality makes you irresistible to women and respected, my, uh, respected by men. Hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. I will see you guys tomorrow, man. Peace.